any amount of mass, you can calculate how small it would have to be, how compressed it would have to be for it to become a black hole. If you wanted Earth to become a black hole, you'd have to shrink it down to like the size of a plum. Last I did the math on that. So if you manage to do that, bada bing, you have an Earth black hole. The point is, a lower mass black hole is smaller than a higher mass black hole. The black hole begins losing mass it gets smaller and becomes the black hole size appropriate for the amount of mass it has. Gotcha. So, so it's so stuck being a black hole. It's always going to be a black hole. Correct. No matter what mass is, now that it has collapsed into a black hole, it can't be anything else. As it shrinks down, that's right. Now, if for some magic force of nature, the black hole evaporates according to Hawking radiation, which, which your guy clearly knows about, and somehow did not get smaller, would be a point where the density would no longer Longer allow it to be a black hole because it's about the density it's not about the mass right. the density would know it, and then the black hole would slowly reveal itself as a solid object